Hello everybody and a good day to you all. Today I'm talking about Jessica Jones episode number 7 aka Top Shelf Perverts. Yeah. In this episode Jessica Jones comes up with a plan to bring out Kilgrave. To draw him out. And she's going to use herself as bait to make sure this happens. Because a court, the way her plan is going to work, he's going to be forced to expose himself and use his powers in public. And in that way, people will know that there is a man out there who's controlling people using mind powers. And then the girl Hope, who's, who's the victim of all this, for was actually being controlled to kill her parents. And maybe she'll get, Scott, she'll get, she'll go, she'll get out of jail scot-free. But the only thing is that the problem is Jessica has to sacrifice herself for this to happen. And because this plan may or may not work in her favor, her friends get involved to try to stop her from making such a huge, huge mistake. Well, I can't say the plan worked because I'm gonna start, I'm almost say I'm gonna say this much right here. And this, this is a saying when you can't beat them. I guess you join them. Yeah. Well, this is another great episode. And, and, and again, David Tennant as Kilgrave is just killing it. Because there's a scene in this thing that is so creepy. And it's so messed up. Like, oh my gosh. Matter of fact, there's a couple of them in there. There's, there's pretty much two major ones that get you. And it's just, oh. Because, see, his, the, way, the way he controls people and makes them do things, and the way he just gets away with it, it's so messed up. Oh, my gosh. And you can see Jessica is falling apart. Her life is crumbling, and she has no control over her life. And she's Because she, she wants to be the hero. She wants to do the right thing. She wants to help people. But all, every time she tries, things just turn to crap. And it just gets worse and worse. And she's blaming her. She, she, and all the blame and all the baggage falling on her. While Kilgrave, even though he is the reason for all the crap, he walks away light as a feather. And, every, and, and Jessica is, is left carrying the huge burden. And, and that's just driving her crazy. So her idea is to, if you just get rid of me, problem goes away. And everybody's happy because I deserve to be punished. Because I may not have been the, the reason for what happened, but I am the cause for what happened. Even though I may not be at fault, it was still my hands that caused it. And the guilt she's feeling and everything else... It's just weighing her down. It's weighing her down. And she's pretty much losing it. Yeah. Oh my god. This this, uh, this show is just, just... What do you know how to punch you in the gut? Wow. But a great episode. I, I'm saying this. I'm going to keep saying this. I highly recommend it. Check out Jessica Jones. A great show to watch. I can't... I don't know how this story is going to end. I don't know how who's gonna end up on top, but I'm I'm willing to find out. Great show. I'm loving this show. That's all I gotta say about that. So leave your comments down below if you have any thoughts or opinions about the, what you just saw on this episode. Leave your comments down below. And give my channel a big old like, hit the, hit the thumbs up. Boom, and subscribe to my channel and share. I really would appreciate it. So like I always say in my dreams and in real life, I am the Ninja Rabbit. A peace out of peoples.